guys welcome back to my channel so today I am gonna be talking about everything I got from Ulta's 21 days of beauty so if you don't know Ulta does it I think like twice a year at least twice a year they do 21 days of beauty and I think they also do like a 21 days of like skincare and hair and all that stuff as well but 21 Days of Beauty, where, like, full-size, your favorite makeup stuff is on sale for, like, half off. And while that's going on, they also have other sales going on as well. And if you are platinum or diamond, you can order these items, all you, like, one item, and it gets shipped. It ships free. So, um, I did that because I am platinum. I don't know if I want to say that out loud. <laughs> I do buy a lot of makeup, um, but I don't just buy makeup there. I buy hair care. Um, I buy like my facial stuff. I buy lotion, all that stuff. Um, so if you don't join, go to Ulta, join their um, membership. You get points, which I love. I always save up my points throughout the year and then use them in December to buy gifts. So um, it's awesome. And then you always get like coupons and other little things like that. But I wanted to show you guys what I ended up getting for 21 Days of Beauty. Um, I'm going to go ahead and pull up my Ulta account so that way I can tell you how much these items go for and how much I ended up paying for them um, from the sales. So hold on one second. Let me see. It started in March and ran till about... Actually, I know exactly when it ended. It ended April 6th because my oldest boy's birthday is April 7th. So, like, perfect timing, right? <laughs> okay, so um, the first thing I got from Ulta's 21 Days of Beauty is the Smashbox Cali Contour um, Palette. So, I was really excited about this because I do enjoy Smashbox and I love contour palettes. So... This is it right here. The packaging is beautiful. I love it. And it comes with, let me, oh, I have not opened um, any of this stuff. So I wanted to save it for you guys so we could open it together. But it has a great mirror for like traveling. And then um, it comes with, and I'll do it this way so you guys can see. So it has your contour highlight matte bronze matte blush a shimmer highlight and a shimmer bronze highlight so these are the shades right here and this palette normally let me pull it up so yeah i don't tell you guys go wrong it normally goes for 39 dollars, and i ended up spending 19.50 on it so that that's awesome um because honestly i don't know if i would have spent 40 dollars Oh, if you can hear like some weird breathing noise, it's my dog down here underneath the desk. So, um, but, and then it's not that I don't like anything, but I haven't tried it out yet. So, um, I'm really excited and who knows, I might try it out and I might love it and I might buy me another one for $39, but I couldn't pass up the price cause I've been looking at it for a really long time. So I was really excited to see it come up. And there were a few things that I looked at that I ended up not purchasing, either because I waited too long and I didn't get to, um, it was sold out by the time I went online. A lot of this stuff, I don't think I actually went in store. I purchased everything online. So, um, I don't know. I have that Ulta right but like down the street from where I work, but... Uh, it was easier for me to just pull up the app, order, and boom, I'm done. I don't have to go anywhere. So, the next thing that I ordered, ooh, this order um, had quite a few things. So, I got, um, like I, I don't know if you guys watched my previous video, but I've been um, trying to find a good eye primer because normally I just do my foundation and powder and then I'm good to go, which, I don't know, I kind of want to try something new. So, um, I got, everyone talks about Max Paint Pots, so I got this one in Soft Ochre, 
So this is it right here, and they normally go for $22, but Ulta had them on sale for $11. So um, I figured perfect timing, I get to try out the um, product and not have to pay full price for it. So I'm really excited to try this out. I know a lot of people on YouTube rave about it for the eyeshadows, so I'm really excited to see what it does for mine. The other two things I got were $10 a piece, and they normally go for $17. Um, but they're the Dose of Colors Lip It Up Satin Lipsticks. So I got two of them. Let me open it up. I got this one right here in the shade. Ooh, if I can open it up. And the packaging is just so cute. Like, how can you not love that? But this one is in the shade Mocha, which I'll swatch for y'all. I mean, it's my typical. If you guys watch me for a while, mauves, kind of my thing. So, um, mauves and nudes. So, this is Mocha right here. And I like, I've been wanting to try their stuff, and it really intrigues me. If you guys can see how the lipstick is shaped, that, like, wide shape like that. So, um, I'm really intrigued to see how it's going to work being put on. But, so I got, I did get this one in Mocha, and then the other color I got was Cinnamon Swirl. So, and these were only 10 bucks, but this is Cinnamon Swirl. Oh. So these are it right here. So I'm really excited to try, oh, I'm like stabbing this lipstick all over the place. Oh terrible <laughs> but I'm really excited to try them out and they feel really nice and creamy so um I got those two for 10 bucks and that MAC Paint Pot for 11 and then the next thing I got I'm trying to go down here so that way I can just pull my order so you guys can see them I got a uh, MAC Prep and Prime which I really enjoy but this one is in this scent coconut so, I've really, and I don't normally, like, these go for $27, and I got it for $13.50. And, growing up, I didn't like anything coconut scents, um, food, anything like that. But, lately, I have, like, loving coconut smells. So, oh, yes, it just smells so beachy. I love it. So, I was really excited to get a large one. And the scent is nice. I mean, it literally smells like the beach. So, for $13.50, you can't pass that. You can't pass that up. The next one I got, in this order, I did get quite a few things. Because there's so much stuff I wanted to try. So, um, I got the Smash Smashbox Photo Finish Primerizer. So, I've only tried this once. And it was like a trial, like mini thing. And I loved it right but it is so expensive I paid $21 and it is normally $42 for this but it's so nice and it feels so good on your skin that I had to get it I had to get the full size because I loved the mini and when I went back to go get the full size I was shocked at how expensive it was so I, I just never could bring myself to buy or purchase it but for $21 I will buy that so, I did get Smashbox Primerizer. Um, really excited to try that out. I, try, I, or I tried. I haven't tried it yet. I got the Beauty Bakery um, Setting Powder. So, I've really been wanting to try Beauty Bakery stuff. Their packaging is just so unbelievably cute. Like, I mean, just adorable. Like, look at this. It looks like a little bag of flour. So, um, oh, and on the back it says baking tips. How cute. So, I figured this was like a good little step to try something out and um, branch off into, if I love it, I can try out more stuff. So, um, I paid $12 for this and this normally goes for $24. So, let me open her up. But... Which, this is perfect timing because I literally just ran out of some powder. And I can use this. But, oh my gosh, this is so cute. So, this is it right here. It is Beauty Bakery Flower Better Not Better. So, how cute. 
and then I got it in translucent. So, because um, I love translucent powder, but I mean packaging, oh, to die for. So $12, normally $24, perfect. And then I also got um, two of the Nude Sticks Magnetic Matte Lip Colors. So I've, a lot of people talk about Nude Sticks on YouTube. Really intrigued me, I've been wanting to try them. Um, they have a display at my Ulta, and I've always gone in and just watched their stuff and looked at it, but I've never purchased. So I spent $13. Um, on each of them. They're normally 26 but I got two of them, so it's like two for the price of one. But I got, um, they're both satin shades, so the first one I got, I'll show you, um, I got in rose, so you open it up, it comes with a little packaging like this, you open it up, and it has a little mirror, I don't want to shine you guys out, but a little mirror on the inside of the tin, and then it comes like this, and you open her up, Ooh. And um, this came with, let's see, it has like a little sharpener so you can sharpen her up and then let's unwrap her so that way I can swatch her for you guys. So I'm really excited to try these out because I love lips, lip colors. So this was in the shade Rose. Oh yes, that is a beautiful color. So this is her right here. Perfect color for me. I know it looks very eerily similar to the other one, but I mean they're different. Trust me, they're different. <laughs> if my husband walked in here, he'd tell you they're the same, but they're different. And then the other color I got was Saint. So it's same packaging, um, mirror in the tin on the lid, and then it comes with the um, sharpener, so you can sharpen it. Oh yeah, that is a beautiful color. And then this is Saint right here. So, I know, I. I know guys, I know. These look so similar, but they're not. I promise they're not. Um, besides, you can never have enough lipsticks. So those are the two right there, and I'm super excited to try them out. And then the next thing I got, oh yes, this, another setting powder. Um, because everyone talks about this, and I've been wanting to try this so bad. But it's the um, Too Faced Born This Way, the Ethereal Setting Powder, and I got it in translucent. But look at that. How gorgeous is that packaging right there? So I'm super excited. I know I've got a lot of um, new powders to try out. So. But I got this for $16.50, and it's normally $33. So... This is like literally 21 Days of Beauty is the perfect time to um, try out a bunch of new stuff that you've never tried before because you're not having to pay full price for it. So, but it opens up like this and it has the little lid cover. So you just pop it up like this. So that's like perfect traveling powder right there. So I'm really pumped. And I really enjoy um, translucent powders. For me, I don't normally buy ones with color. It's either translucent or banana is what I normally stick to. So I'm really excited. The next thing I got was, um, which I'm super excited about because I really enjoy it. It's the Too Faced Chocolate Soleil um, Matte Bronzer. So this is in their newer packaging. I had a bronzer. Um, it was a mini in their old packaging. I had it for forever and it took me a while to get through it. Um, but I loved it and then I used it all up when I cried. Well, no, I didn't really cry, I'm sorry. Um, but I used it all up and I've been wanting to buy another one, but I paid $15 for this and it's normally 30 bucks. But this is the new packaging that it comes in and I love how it smells like chocolate, y'all. So it comes like this and it's just like the perfect bronzer for your face. 
And I love that sense of chocolate. It smells so good. Like, I could eat it. But it's perfect. So get it for half, half price. Uh, I seriously thought about buying two of them. But I didn't. I only bought one. And then the last thing I got for my thing, my order, was um, you guys know how recently I've been using Benefits um, Gimme Brow. I bought the trial size because I didn't know if I would really like it and I didn't want to shell out the money for a full size. So they had the full size versions, which are normally $24, and I spent $12 on it. So I got, I used Benefit Gimme Brow in the shade 5. So I was able oh, able to get it. Now it wouldn't be a video if I didn't drop something, huh? I was able to get it the full size for half price. So that worked out perfect because my trial little trial size now is like starting to I'm starting to use it up because I use it every day. But I really enjoy it. So I was really excited to see it on there for half price. But that is it for this video. Um, leave a comment down below. Let me know if you did um, participate in Ulta's 21 Days of Beauty. What did you buy? What are your favorites? What are you excited to try out if you bought something new? Um, but that is it. Be sure and give this video a thumbs up. Don't forget to subscribe and hit that notification bell to be notified every time I upload a video. And I hope you guys have a wonderful day. Bye y'all.